What's up guys and welcome back to Wall Street Millennial. Today we're going to go over some of the biggest gains and losses on options trades from the Wall Street Bets Forum over the past week. This way we can learn from the experiences of our fellow options traders. First off we have a tale of only red with user Sharpie posting a screenshot showing his Robinhood portfolio over the past couple years. Currently with a portfolio value of less than $1, he is down more than $31,000 all time or approximately 100%. This unfortunate fate of his portfolio saw most of his destruction in 2019, but a few trades during the pandemic of 2020 finished off the remainder of his portfolio. The comment section rips him for his failure, with the user I am the apocalypse telling him that options trading is obviously not his game. Other users ask him to please post his trades before he makes them, undoubtedly for the purpose of other Wall Street Bets users being able to reverse those trades ahead of time. Sharpie tries to deflect some of the abuse by claiming that from his chart, you can see that he made about 5 good trades even if his 2 bad trades made him lose everything. However, as Trojan Mana points out, when you are making all or nothing YOLOs, you'll lose everything 50% of the time. At this rate, you are sure to see your account go to zero eventually. While he doesn't provide his exact stock picks that caused his losses, he does give an idea of his general trading strategy. Most of his trades were on options that are within 2 days of expiry. These options are especially risky because Theta Decay is greatest just before expiry. Next up we have the user Mr. Colchado with a very nice $26,000 gain on Zoom options. With only about a $3,000 initial investment, this means that this trade was almost a 10-bagger. Zoom Video, as we all know, has been one of the great tendy stories of this year, up more than 500% since a year ago. However, its stock has pulled back somewhat since October, as investors feared that the tailwind from the pandemic will end with the dissemination of a vaccine. Some Wall Street Bets users question whether Mr. Colchado can really keep these gains through the end of the year, as spectacular gains can frequently be as quick to go as they were to come. Especially when these gains are made through options trading, it doesn't take much for a winning trade to lose its gains, even if the underlying stock doesn't go down that much. Next up we have the user aborak 6 who lost more than 98% of his portfolio in the past 3 months alone. Despite the overall market having hit all-time highs multiple times during this period, this Wall Street Bets user never saw his account in the green. He lost his money in two main tranches, separated by a brief period in which he did not do much trading. With his last remaining $89, some Wall Street Bets users have advice for what to do. Some suggest cashing out and buying something nice with his remaining funds, while others encourage him to continue his trading and lose the last $89. User Bardown61 suggests out of the money calls on GameStop, one of the most recent Wall Street Bets meme stocks. The original poster responds that why should he trust his judgment, to which Bardown tells him that his wife will vouch for him. Whatever you end up doing with your $89 account, we wish you well. Let's round out the video with a nice 10x gain on Intel options. User OK Traffic turned $5,000 into $50,000 on $50 strike calls expiring on December 18th. Although Intel has been stuck in a sideways motion for the past few years, the most recent month has seen many options traders holding calls on the stock to see significant gains. Intel recently surpassed the $50 strike price of his calls, which marks the point where increases in stock price start to cause significant increases in the value of calls. If Intel can continue to increase above $50, OK Traffic will likely continue to see incredible gains. User NewSet3059 asks what caused him to enter this favorable trade. OK Traffic responds that he knows significant overselling of the stock, even as massively positive market sentiment was permeating through the market. Congratulations on your massive win. Alright guys, that wraps it up for this video. If you like this content, make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video. If you have any recent gains or losses, let us know in the comment section below. As always, we thank you for your support. Wall Street Millennial, signing out.